How to turn an old Steam Link box into a retro gaming machine. This process doesn't replace the firmware on the hardware. It only adds RetroArch as a standalone application. Let's get started. On your flash drive create the folder Steam Link. In that folder create two more folders called Apps and Config. In the config folder create a folder called system. And in there create a text file called enable ssh. This will allow access to the box using tools like winscp and putty. Download the RetroArch application file from the link in the description. Put the file in the Steam Link Apps folder. Connect the flash drive to the first USB port in the Steam Link box while the power is unplugged. When powered up, the installation process will start automatically on boot. RetroArch is now installed on the Steam Link box. Please keep watching for additional tweaks and instructions on how to install optimized system cores. Launch RetroArch for the first time so it can auto-create some folders. The default paths for cores, info, and system will be changed. Save the current configuration. Use the online updater to update the assets. Extract the contents of the downloaded retro boot. Copy autoconfig up to the Steam Link box. Copy the cores and info folders to the Steam Link box.
Connect to the Steam Link box with SSH and run the commands to decompress the updated cores. Add any of your own files and enjoy. Please subscribe, like and comment.